Hello, everybody. Welcome back. Welcome back to, you know, another episode of Stray, everybody. We are back. Continuing. Alrighty, so we gotta find, uh, like, music, something music-related or something. Okay. What am I looking for? We found three notebooks, one more, and we're good. Okay. Okay. Okay, we just need one more notebook. So we check there. I think we have to go over there. Jump, jump. Whew. I'm a kitty cat. I'm a kitty cat. Here, go here, here. There we go. How do I get in here? Ah, I see. Drop this. Woo! Nice place. Need some water. Alrighty. What are we looking for? place we have to find the notebook? Where's the notebook? I don't see a notebook in here. Remember? Remarkable companions have evolved so much. In the early days, their simple AI merely imi imitated human art. Now this is all their own. Humans often said that making art is important in desperate situations. These are certainly desperate times. I think the outsiders seem to live in the upper flats. We won't find anything in these narrow streets. I don't think we... here remember it looks it looks like this poor guy also wanted to go to the upper level Yes, I remember. Midtown is up there, away from all the garbage and sickness of the slums. Even in dire times, humans can't, could not help but divide themselves by social class. 
Back then, a lot of people from slums were prepared to do anything to move up there. Apparently, robots also copied the, this behavior. Gotta find a way back, go back across. Okay. Wait, what the heck is this? Did we go over here? I think we went over here before, right? Okay. You should be able to see them from all from the out rooftops. Look for an outsider logo. So we went we went in here. So the only place we haven't checked really is this place over to the right. We are jumping like crazy. Translate. Ventilation power supply. Okay, it has to be in here somewhere, right? this file Did we get it finally the last notebook this one seems to belong to someone named Zelbaltzar all trace of organic life has disappeared except for what we call the Zerks they seem to eat almost anything that moves and breed at an inconceivable rate as if being locked in the city wasn't hard enough oh there's also a note in this book. It says, I found a design flaw in the transceiver, but I think I figured out how to fix it. Here's the, qu here's the equation. With this, we should be able to help Momo repair the transceiver. If, we, if it can communicate with the upper levels, that could be our way up. Way up. Let's show him what we found. So down to that one robot, right? Okay, we found the outsiders. Found the four and a note on how to fix the transceiver. Momo up on the building with the orange neon. Orange neon. Orange neon, orange neon. He's up there. Hey little cat, are you still looking for those useless notebooks? 
show item. Well, you found Clementine's notes. She was really brave, you know, the most fearless person I've ever met. That's my notebook. I was the last to join the Outsiders, and I'm also the last remaining one. Oh, it belonged to Doc. He was really a huge nerd for electronics and stuff. He was always on the verge of a great discovery. That's the Boltzer's notebook, right? I never quite understood what he was talking about most of the time, but he was very wise. Wait, you actually found all my friend's notebooks? Yeah. Oh, what's the note? The transceiver can be repaired. This is incredible. That means we should be able to communicate outside of the slums. Clementine is a, is a Boltzer doc. I'm sorry, I doubt our cause. I promise you I will find a way to reach the surface. Thank you, we might be able to find you a way up. Now let's fix this piece of junk transceiver. El Voil, it works. Come with me. Up there, see that building high above the others? If you install the transceiver at the very top of the tower, we should be able to communicate with the whole city. My friends might still be out there. If there is a way out, they'll know. Ian and I know. You're the only one small and quick enough to evade the Zerks. We need you, little outsider, bring us to the sky. Alrighty, we're going down here. Jump, jump. Rooftops. Oh shit, danger. Is there any danger here? Run! Walk along this like a cat would. Shit. Woo! Woo! Jump! Go up. Quick! Remember? The city is full of neon. It wasn't always this way. There used to be strict energy caps, especially in the slums, but people couldn't handle the constant darkness. One day someone lit up rainbow lamps, neon signs all over their house. That person was taken away and never seen again. But people saw hope and not long after everyone started putting lots of lights in their homes, there was nothing the oppressors could do. It was a way for people to see colors again, like on the outside, I think it helped. Jump up. I don't know if I'm going the right way, but hell. Oops. 
Hector. Hector. There we go. Those things are weird. <laughs> Looking at those things. Ugly sons of bitches. Okay. I think I have to go this way, right? I think I have to go up there, right? I think so. What do I do over here? Climb up here? Always away, right? Always away. Oh shit. Just jump up, go up here. Shit. These things are everywhere. Jump! Whew. Come over here. Ah, uh, get out of me! Get out of me! Get out of me! Get out of me! Oh. I couldn't jump down! Retry. Retry. I couldn't jump down. At all. Like, I mean at all. I was like, trying to jump down. I'm like, why am I sitting? Okay. That was, that was dumb by me. Okay. Let's do this again. Go in here. Jump over here. Jump over here. Woo! Woo! Jump up! I got this. Oh, oh, hello. Keep going. Come back, come back, go, 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 go. Quickly as possible. Perfect. Did he just die? Where do I have to take this? Jump up, these little shits. Oh shit. Okay. Jump. Whoo! Not happening. What does this do? Oh, elevator. 
Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. Keep running. Keep running. <laughs> Shit, hurry up, elevator. Oh, there's more of you. There's a shit out of these damn things. Oh no. Oh no. Ugh. Use elevator. Glad they don't jump that high. Tiny cat. Tiny cat. Okay, it won't open. Gotta jump up. Here it is. Put the transceiver on this antenna. Where? Right here? Use item? Use item. We did it. We did good. We did good. Look at the view, it's beautiful from here. Remember now the city, it was meant to be a shelter. Those look like stars, but they're only lights making the hermit roof ceiling off the city. Humankind built this shell to protect themselves from the outside, but it came at a cost. Nobody can go out. The outside was a disaster, completely barren, unlivable, and dangerous. But if you came from there, it must mean it's safe again. And my promise wasn't just to go to the outside, it was to open the city. I still don't understand why some memories are coming back and others aren't. But I'm certain now this is my purpose. I have to open the city. Come on, let's go back and find Momo. Now that we've connected the transmitter, we should be able to get help. Oh, you're not gonna see. Oh. Alrighty. Slums part two. Now we gotta talk to. Look a note. Little outsider, if you're reading this, that means you're still alive. Excellent. I took some equipment to the bar to take advantage of their antenna. Come meet me there. I've locked the window, but the code to the opening is quite simple. It is... Huh? Be careful, it is case sensitive. See you at the bar, Momo. That must be the code for the window na near the entrance. Let's go. Here's the lock for the window. The code was... Hmm, it was a uh, H, I think. Error, wrong key. Oops, my my bad. Okay, let's try that again. Hmm. And then it was oh, it was it easier. Let's see. Yep, it worked. Momo was at the bar waiting for us. Where's the bar? Bar. 
I don't even know where the bar is. Go here, down here. Oh, is this the bar? Yep, bar. Hey, little furball. Come here, I managed to get a signal. Sweet. I want to jump on the, the stool. There we go. Let me see if I can get this thing working. Huh? <laughs> I've almost got it. Hello, can anyone hear me? Hello, yes, we can hear you. We are from the slums. We're looking for a way out and... Wait, is that you, Zavolsar? Momo? I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice, Avulsar. Where are you? Are the others okay? Yes, we are safe. We found a way up. H hello, do you still hear me? You have to go through the sewers to reach us. Very dangerous. Zerks everywhere. Sewers? How? Hello? Darn it, we lost the signal. I can't believe Zavolsar is alive. He and the other outsiders managed to go up through the sewers. The sewers are the most dangerous place in the slums, but if Zavolsar made it, there must be a way. You'll never get past the sewers. It's infested with Zerks. They'll make a quick meal out of you, especially you, little one. Many tried their luck in the past. It doesn't end well. Anyway, I warned you, your business is none of my business. I'll make it through there. Hmm, Sim... Seamus? His father, Doc, used to be a great scientist. He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago, he went off to test the device and never came back. Seamus has never been the same since. Sounds like a job for me. Don't listen to Seamus, he's just scared like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the Outsiders. In his notebook, Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. That must be where he was working on it. There might be a clue in Seamus' apartment. Come on, follow me. I'm a kitty cat. What's up, dude? <laughs> I'm a cat doing some cat things. Translate. Now it's I'm looking for any sheet music to play the guitar to add some ambience. If you find any, bring them to me, back to me. I'm leaving in the elevator, Musky. Oh, okay. Come on, Sue, open the door. You know your father would have wanted to help us. Well, that has, was to be expected. This situation is pretty tough on Seamus. He doesn't want to hear about the outsiders anymore. He won't help me. But you, I think I have an idea. Where are we going? Here, take Doc's notebook and show it to Seamus. Doc's notebook gained new item. Gains a lot of information that will helpful, hopefully act as an electro shock. Find the secret lab, little outsider. I'm going back to the bar to try to reestablish communication with the others. What are you doing in here? I told you getting through the sewers is a suicide mission. Leave me be. Show Adam. What's this? Wait, is this my papa's? Oh wow, I never knew. 
There's a secret room here in our flat, but where? She music. Right under my nose, maybe there are clues hidden somewhere around here. Take this. What is this? Translate. Time will tell. <laughs> I'm knocking everything over. What is this? Use input code. Translate. Time will tell. Is there anything else around here? I never noticed that digital code before. How did I miss it? I have no idea what the password is. Password could be. Time will tell. Hmm. I'm gonna try something. Let me see. One, two, eight, three. Got it. I've never seen this room. I can't believe he managed to hide it from me all this time. These blueprints, they must be for his Zerk weapon. Papa was always so secretive with his work. He told me the weapon was working in theory, but it needed a real life test. He went outside the slums and he never came back. Anything in there? Nothing? Translate. Robots news headline. Zerk are officially no longer under control. They now eat metal. Find anything interesting in there? Translate. Observation. Cute. Sound, acute sounds, but never friendly. Old bacteria of human time eat all kinds of materials. Totally vision in the dark. React to the intense light. I don't know what I'm supposed to do in here. Fluxer, blueprint concept, 
Light based handgun, low priority visual appearance, size, deliberately limit, high priority testing, real condition, objective, 20 zerk destroyed per second. Anything interesting in here? What am I supposed to do in here? What am I supposed to do? Secret of all scientists have a secret lab. The Zerk weapon should be around here. this show item wait I remember that that's the his tracker I've always used that tracker to keep an eye on where I was maybe we can reverse it to find where he went can't believe my papa might still be alive I missed him so much I need a weapon for the Zerch, right? My papa definitely took one with him. We just need to repair the tracker so we can find him. Someone in the slums should be able to help. Come with me, I'll open the door for you. Found it! They out... I'm outside. You gotta fix the tracker. You've re you're resourceful. Maybe you can find someone in the slums to help. You're clever. Surely we can find. Okay. We need to get to that. We need to get that tracker repair. Let's show it to some folks in the slums. Maybe they can point us in the right direction. First person. Those guys better not drop paint bucket again, or else Cosmo. Okay. What's that thing? A tracker? I don't know anything about the high tech stuff. Try the bar. Where's the bar? Bar's gotta be over here, right? Grandma made me a scarf. Your tracker's in bad shape. Bartender might help you find someone who can fix it. Bartender! You're new around here. What can I do for you? What a beautiful object in Rare 2. I know a guy who fixes stuff like this. He's very talented, just a little wa a little well, you'll see. His name's Elliot. His office is just left of here near Grandma's shop. There are signs all over his door. His name's Jacob, so he's right around over here, right? Grandma clothing. Elliot programming still this way. Translate grandma clothing. Elliot, it's got to be over here, right? Is 
Is this it over here? What is this? Remember. Rest in peace, humans. Humans were the first residents around here. It seems that they're all dead now. What do you think it feels like being dead? I know it's silly coming from me, but are they at, actually at peace? Will I be at peace when I die? I don't know what death feels like for an AI. I'm sorry, I didn't want to break the mood. Let's move on. What is this? Whoa! Where's Elliot's? I don't even know where Elliot's at, is at. Did I go the wrong way? Me. So today... That kid Elliot who lives there is real tech. Is he up here? I do not know. Translate. Looking for someone capable of monitoring the... Okay. Where's Elliot's? I don't even know where Elliot's is at. So back this... What? Where? Elliot's is this way. Do so far I've needed four okay. Bring me some electric cable I could make you a poncho. You just talk to Elliot for things like this. He's a little whiz with electronic, he just lives over there. Tracker, right? It looks fixable. Ask at the bar, they can help. Okay, I don't know where Elliot's is at. This has got to be the bar. Yeah, I'm back at the bar. Where's Elliot's? Wish there's a map. Where's Elliot's? Elliot's has got to be this way, right? Elliot's. It's gotta be over here, right? Did I pass something? It's okay, you can leave. The Guardian said it was not the Zerks. I am so confused on where Elliot's is at. It's... I'm gonna have to look on it. I have to look it up. Because Elliot's is no... I don't see it. Is this it? Oh, that's Seamus. Where the hell is Elliot's? Translate. Elliot programming is this way it's saying, right?
Grandma made me so stylish, no? Oh, if you want the repair, you must go see Elliot. Scratch his door just there on your on your right. Translate. Elliot found it. Knock on the door and wait for us to open. Open. You're here for Elliot. He's just over there. You should show. Okay. Where's Elliot? Take this. Yo, Elliot! Yes, can I help you? Oh, well, that's great. Tracker, I recognize this model. It's a Toma BR2000. You can track anyone with this little gadget, may I? I know how to repair it, but when I'm trembling like this, I can't use my keyboard. I don't know if I'm sick or something, but I definitely don't feel right. I can't work when I'm shivering like this. I think I need a blanket to be able to fix your tracker. No thanks, I'm not thirsty. Remember? This tree is scientific, scientific marvel. It's remarkable that human ingenuity found a way to create plants that thrive without sunlight. Organic life requires trees to purify the city's air. Robots don't need it, but they take care of them anyway. It's what the humans would have wanted. Don't worry, the tracker's safe here with me. But I can't work on it unless I have cloth. A cloth to keep me warm. I can't focus. I need to find some cloth. Okay, I need to get some cloth. Okay, go to grandma's clothing place here. I love knitting, so far I've knitted, okay. Electronic and I could give you a poncho. Where's electronic cable? Oh, hey, it's you. You do look weird and small, but there's something about you. I feel compelled to pay you, but I won't because I don't understand why. <laughs> Alrighty, everybody. I'm going to end this episode here. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Stray. I got to find electric electronic cable so I'm gonna look that up um, definitely gonna look it up because I have no idea where this electronic cable would be at to be honest but hope you guys enjoyed this one please drop a like comment and please do subscribe it does help out on channel I'll see you guys all in the next one to come peace out and goodbye